Hi everybody, just a very short video today to look at a very powerful tool that can help us when we're working with a lot of points. I've got a, a drawing that I'm working on right now that's got a number of points in it. If I select points from the prospector window, I can scroll up and down through the item list and see that there are a fair amount of points here. Now depending on what I'm doing, maybe I'm creating a stakeout, maybe I'm creating more points, uh, could be using points for a number of reasons. There'll be times that I want to know available point numbers, what point numbers are currently vacant that I could utilize uh, when I create more points. Uh, trying to determine that from the item list may be a little challenging, but there's a much faster and better way to do it. Uh, if we type the command in, as we start to type in list, we see the command is list available point numbers. We'll go ahead and select that, and it immediately tells us down in the command line what points are currently available. So it shows us uh, two uh, is currently available, a gap between 20 and 770, and then you can work your way up um, throughout the list to see what points are currently available. All right, very powerful tool. Um, some folks may be wondering where it's at in the ribbon. If I have some points selected, the contextual ribbon that appears on the screen, if we were to come up under Kogo Point Tools, we would find it down under here as well. However, uh, sometimes we want to know that without selecting the points, and when we, uh, when we do, we would just type it in at the command line. So anyway, once again, a uh, very short, uh, sweet video today. It is uh, one of those tools that does what it says, says what it does. So if you're somebody who works with points and you need to know what points are available, numbers haven't been used in your current model, you can uh, utilize list available points to figure that out. So hope this helps, and I'll talk to you again soon. See ya.